here we are back at it. We've got this uh, foundation that we're about to pour on this 50 by 50 barn dominium. So half of it's gonna be living quarters, the other half will be shop area. So this morning we're pouring the foundation and then we're gonna come back later and do the flat work on the porches. So it's been a little bit hectic this morning just trying to get everything, uh, double check everything and we're gonna measure off for the doors. Um, we gotta put our embeds in as well after the concrete goes in for our weld plates for the steel. for ground so we use this right here where the meter base is going to go so basically what it does is it grounds to the concrete through the rebar and it creates a ground through the concrete slab as opposed to just grounding into the earth itself because they've determined that the concrete itself is better ground than the earth so uh, that's what that is so we'll actually connect this to the meter base and the box, it'll be grounded to this. So they sent us two trucks already, but we're ready for the next one. Concrete's not here, so uh, usually we get pretty good service. So we're trying to make sure that they keep them coming because this is Texas heat coming in today. I don't know what the temperature is right now. It's pretty cool because the sun just came up. Well, 45 minutes later, here's our next truck. We just work with what we got. A little later than I wanted, but we're uh, pressing on anyhow. So right now we got 40 yards poured. Other truck should be here any minute. Right now we're uh, using the bull float going across. What it does is kind of pushes the aggregate to the bottom and then brings the cream to the top. So it gives you something to work with on the finish. And over here, the guys are They don't have any more concrete to pour right, or to pull right now, but they've been pulling it according to, you can see I have a stake over here in the center. Um, they set the elevation height and they put a nail on that stake determining what the height is. So that way they can double check their height as they're pulling the concrete level from the form boards all the way across. So uh, that's kind of what's happening right now. Okay guys, so today was a really good day. Uh, had good weather, it was just a little hotter than anyone would probably want to have, but um, we got it poured, even though we, you know, we waited a little bit in between truckloads, but we got it done. 
And so now we've just got the front porch and back porch left to pour. We've got that already uh, formed up, ready to go. And we'll be doing that later in this week. But the slab is poured, it's 55, I mean a 50 by 50 Barnuminium concrete foundation. So I hope you'll stay tuned for more updates and we look forward to getting the framing and all that stuff going on this one. So like, share, and subscribe. We appreciate you watching. Talk to you soon.